Nicholas Cannon and I specialize in watercolor tattoos. I do watercolor tattoos because it's uh, I find that it's a more creative way of, of expression. I've painted since I'm three years old and I tried uh, oils, um, spray painting, digital painting for a while. Watercolors I like a lot just because it's very fluid. Tattooing is something that you carry all the time. Every watercolor tattoo is unique because the, the splashes, the line work, the line work is a lot messier. But I liked it, I liked it because it was very different, very unique. So it was not the stereotypical bold outline, solid feeling kind of tattoo. Some people who are learning if, if they're good, if they have good artwork, and they make good designs, the execution can always be fixed, you know? They do it once, it's a good tattoo, and then people can touch it up. But you can have a B design with an A execution, that like you can have a perfectly well executed bad design, and you are and you end up with a bad design. It's just, you know, like an ugly piece with clean line work. So I feel that now that I'm an artist, a tattoo artist, I owe it to people to make sure that if they come to me with an idea, that I sit down and, and that we create the best that we can out of that idea, you know, instead of just taking whatever they want, tattooing it. And he understands that at the end of the day, is it's about the client. I may want to create my art, but the person carrying it is not me. You know, there's someone else who's gonna carry that for the rest of their life. So, so you know, in a way, we are we are serving the person. We want to create, and but we have to get sometimes our ego out of the way to to serve that person.